close to 300 facilities in the Bono, Bono East and Half regions who have not renewed their Ghana Tourism Authority operational license, along with those who have never registered with the authority, will be closed down. This according to the Ghana Tourism Authority. Some of the facilities that have been closed down in the Sunyani municipality include restaurants, drinking spots, chop bars, guest houses, among others. Manager of the authority for the Bono, Bono East and Half regions, Joseph Apiaje, has been speaking on the exercise. As part of our core mandate, we are supposed to ensure that operators of in the hospitality industry, accommodation, restaurants, entertainment centers, traditional caterers, they have to comply with the law. There is an airline that regulates them. And in the Tourism Act 817, LI has been fashioned to regulate all these operators. So this year, all over the country, some started a couple of weeks ago, we have been closing down illegal operators, those who are not complying with the law, to give them a window of opportunity to come to our office, come and sit with us, Probably some don't know. Some know because some we have issued letters to them. They will come and we tell them to do the right thing. This is the final window of opportunity that we are giving them. Mr. PJ also noted that those who have flouted the law will be prosecuted. For the informal, there are plenty. I can mention about 100 informal facilities. That when officers go there, they don't respect them and they don't comply. Therefore, we have to compare them at this time, advise them. Probably what the officers are saying is not true. I engage them in the office, know their problems and why they want to. We advise them and give them as a final window of opportunity to do their writing. Failure to do so, then we may have to take them to court for the law to take its course. The Ghana Tourism Authority in the Bono region has indicated that facilities who do not comply with the law will be taken to court. For City Business News, I am Michael Saponifum, Sunyane.